So there was a user on Discord and he wanted to know how to hide the object but still render out the shadow. Alright guys, how's it going? I hope you're doing very well. It's been a while since I've actually made a tutorial, kinda rusty to be honest, <laughs> do apologise. Now like I mentioned, the user wanted to hide the object but keep the shadow in the render. Now obviously you have different render engines, you have Eevee and you have Cycles, so I'll cover both of them. Uh, to be honest, I think this should probably be best done inside of Compositor, but sometimes if you're in a pickle you just want to get things done. So let's quickly jump into Cycles first and foremost, and you can see here we have the object, we have the shadow. Now the quickest method is select the object, if you go to the object properties here, you can see visibility and you can see ray visibility and if we untick camera that'll hide the object from the render engine and we now have the shadow in fact you can actually invert this so for example if we take off the shadow and enable the camera we'll just get the object with no shadow now if you want to do multiple objects if you hold down shift to select more than one object and then hit alt on the camera you can see here now of course ev is slightly different and it's probably not the best method let me just put that out there but if you're ever in a jam, what you can do is you can select the object and you can actually go to the materials and you can change this to a transparent material. So if you go to transparent, we then change the blending mode and we'll make this alpha blend. And if we keep the shadow mode opaque, you can see here we hide the object and we still render out the shadow. Not the best method, probably better doing it in compositor. But anyway, do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter, you know what to do. Take care.